like uh, Nasher's. We're going like Nasher's, Luden's, Lichbane, I think, or or maybe no. We're probably just gonna go Nasher's. Nasher's. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. Something spicy. I'm also going for like that mid game spike, cause I like. Vayne is such an easy lane. I don't need runes to kill Vayne, you know? If she kills me and this backfires, I'm an idiot. But I should not need anything to kill to kill Vayne. So we're going to go for something like Nashers. Go for like a, a, a mega like one-shot build. Because they're all, they're all pretty one-shottable. Okay. Wait a minute. Wait. He just shooked us. So you went the wrong way, you silly bean. I use my flash ignite. We'll take it. We'll take it. We'll take it. He warded your blue. That's okay. You know what? Why not two Dorans? Why not two Dorans ring? Right? Why not two Dorans? Two Dorans make a right. You know what I mean? <laughs> two Dorans make a right. <laughs> yeah, I'm going for um. I'm going for something like I went CDR runes and I went transcendence to get the max CDR. I'm going for definitely an AP heavy build. I think I'm just gonna go for something like Nashers. I think I'm going Nashers Luden's uh Nashers Lichbane Death Cap. One shot, one shot build. I'm going the one shot build. Nashers loot Nashers Lichbane Death Cap. Or Nashers Lichbane Luden's Death Cap. No torment this game. Because I feel like I could just one tap all of them. They're all super squishy. That's what we're going for. Hey, Tresito, thanks for trying, buddy. Welcome to the Mighty Moes. Thank you, buddy. Good job, by Vane. I need level two to actually trade with her. You don't want to trade versus anybody level one. That's like not, that's not optimal. Gotta get that level two dog. I can't give her another Q. That's going to be detrimental. Get away from me, jerk. Doink. Hey, <laughs> you missed it. Now you gotta kiss it. Oh. Yeah, back it up. Oh, oh, jeez. She's giving me the poo-poo platter. There's graves over there, I'm guessing. There was a fr there was a ping. Did graves cross over? I didn't see. Okay, yeah. If he pinged it, I'm sure he, he did cross over. Back it up. I didn't see. I didn't see. I can't kill him. He's grazed. He's mighty tanky early. We're just going to get the ward down. Fresh ward. Little poke. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, Vayne's not playing too bad. She's playing pretty decent. We got the harvest proc, though. Once I get my ignite, it'll be a lot easier. We got to be careful of graze behind us here. The graze behind us, the flank is going to be real. Do we pay attention to the map? That's why I'm not really trying to all in her, because like I know Graze is, is doing like our jungle. It's gonna be lurking. The reason why Vayne hasn't died yet is because I used my ignite level one. We see Graze, okay. Then we can look in top soon. There he is. We warded that perfectly. We're actually gonna walk over here to kinda Show him the hey, I just based. Ha ha ha. Don't come top lane. I swear I based. I have a oh, if I get if I can just sneak in here. Come on, Q, Q, Q. Use your Q, use your Q, use your Q. Come on, Q for farm, Q for farm so I can kill you. Q for farm. Q for farm. Come on, I'm asking nicely. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, I couldn't get the last auto. Ah, I couldn't get the last auto. Ah. Oh. I needed to sneak in that last auto. Drats. It's okay. It was, very, it was very, very close. Worth a shot. She got the condemn off. I clicked the I clicked the I clicked the auto attack button. I clicked her. That's all I could do. Close. Where's Graves at? Where's Graves at? I don't think Grids is top. Bard, he'd be top still, right? We're gonna stay. Oh, Grids is bottom. Awesome. Yeah, we'll stay and keep getting some poke on her. <laughs> I can use my Q at will because she can't really engage on me, you know? Hey, turret. What's that love tap for? Do 
It's okay, I got a harvest brock. Another one. Another one. TS level 5 still, so we're looking good. Staring at the map, we see Gray's, we see Gray's bot side. TS still level 5. Press and tab to see that information. Okay, you're lucky I can't catch you like the gingerbread man. I want my level 6. I just want to go for one more wave. I Is TF actually coming? He's level 5. I don't think he's coming. I think he's just kind of spooking me. TF's still level 5. He would have had to walk up here manually. The fucking harvest proc, bro. Okay, I'll take it. I'm out. That's all I wanted. Just, that's all I wanted. I wanted a little harvest proc. Fine. I Realistically, I can't kill her. I don't have Ignite. I can't finish off with auto Q. Go back to base spender or gold doubloons. I'm gonna go for... I'm gonna keep the damage flowing. So we're gonna go this, and we're just gonna keep the damage rolling. So we're gonna keep this right here. Tax speed would be pretty decent here, but I don't need it, need it. Eric, I'm on a smurf, Eric, and this is just like, I want to do a shit ton of damage in the mid game. My build is going to be Nasher's Tooth. It's actually going to be Lucidity Boots, Nasher's Tooth, Lich Bane, Death Cap, something like that. To get my Transcendence to be giving AP and my Death Cap will stack that. So it's a full, this is a full AP one shot build because their team's squishy as all hell. It's pretty much like, I'm going to be one shotting, um, you can't do anything about it, you know? The only person that doesn't die to my one shot is like Graves. TF might survive, but yeah, it's a pretty much a, a full a Smurf one shot build. Not as good as Nash's Torment, but it's gonna be a lot of fun. It's gonna be a little variety, you know what I mean? Bada bing, bada boom. TF is there, awesome. I think now I just. I don't think I want to poke her under turret. I don't think that's a play. I think we just wait. I think she's undisciplined. I think she'll come out and play with me a little bit. So we have to just keep an eye on TF for the TFR. I, don't, I can't really poke her under turret. Oh, is it going to hit that plate? Don't do it, little minions. Don't do it. Nice. The plate stayed. That's so clutch. Good job, plate. See Graves? Don't hit the shroom. We're trying to get a little trade on her. A little poke. If she hits the shroom, I can kill her. No way she actually hits that shroom, right? I just wanted some poke, but this might be free. Come on. Tumble. I wait. I wait still. Okay. Nice. We'll take it. Okay, that's fine. Well, I'll take it, right? Like, I could have just collapsed on grade, so that's more free. Cool, we'll take it. And we get some plates now. I probably shouldn't have killed her. She should have probably played it better, but you know, we'll take it. The, the, the patient bird gets the worm. You can see how much, how little damage I do with Harvest though. Like, on my main account with press the attack or with electrocute, I mean, so much more damage than that. But, it worked. Got the job done. I didn't miss the cannon either. Hooray! Hip up! Hooray! I mean, I highly doubt they can kill me, right? I like this little roam by Eve. Come on! Hit the shroom, minions! Hit the shroom! Don't let her kill it! Thank you. For the harvest proc, we take those. Eve's just hanging out, having a little bit of fun. I respect it. I mean, thanks for it. Makes me feel safe. Makes me feel all warm inside. Thank you, pal. You got this. I'm just going to smack the turret a little bit. Have a little fun up here. If TF ults me, I die. Eve isn't close enough. TF isn't bothering. That's great. Vayne went mid. <laughs> Holy tilt. Holy tilted Vayne. She said, you go top. I'm leaning mid. Fuck Teemo. LOL in all caps. Poor guy. Hey, Bones, what's up, buddy? We go Nashers, right? Just straight Nashers? I don't have enough gold doubloons. 
Okay, don't do this. Don't do this. Don't do this. If you're doing this build, don't do this. Ready? Don't do that. I'm just looking for a better spike. I'm looking to... I want to get a fucking kill when my ignite is up. That's pretty much what I'm going for here. This is very hard to rec play. If I don't get a kill, this build is dumb. If I don't get a kill, this is dumb, right? Just because I bought this just for the earlier spike to have more AP. If I don't get a kill, though, make this worth it. It's very dumb, so it's very risky. I want to get this first turret. It's a lot of gold. A lot of gold on the table. They got Drake. That's no big deal. Cloud Drake. whoop de doo If it's Infernal Drake third, that'd be lovely. Zo doesn't die, right? Nice. Oh, Vayne is so tilted, bro. Vayne just TP'd mid. Oh. Oh, <laughs> Vayne is so tilted, man. He just TP'd mid. Oh, man. Let the ending begin. Poor Vayne got smoked top lane and I was just, like, trolling. <laughs> Poor guy. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay, well, I'm just gonna grab turret. This is the best play I could do. <laughs> Twitch. Oh, what a game. What a game. What a game. This is fun. I could probably kill Graze, right? He doesn't have a magic resist. Graze his bottom. We want to still get plates. Like, if we get a Herald here, we don't even want to use the top. We want to get plates mid, plates bottom. The best thing right now is to get plates. So after I shove this, I'm going to get some plates. Plates are the name of the game. So we're probably going to shove this and go bottom. Bottom or mid. I don't want to actually sit this and hit this turret because the amount of time it's going to take me to get this turret is probably a large amount of time where I just want to go bottom mid and get more plates. Plates are right now 160 gold a plate. This turret is 160 gold just for the, the, the whole turret, right? It's going to take me forever. So we're keeping an eye on the prize. Gold turret build. Again, guys, this is a, a special build I used to go all the time. Um, this is called the Max AP build. Pretty much the concept is we go CDR runes, we go CDR transcendence, and we go a CDR build. So then the transcendence cap, we will go over 40% and we'll start cashing in the AP. It's a really good ratio. So that's the concept. Um, it's like a three to four item spike. That's why I don't use it anymore because it's an early game meta. Three to four item that's unreliable. But we're smurfing. We're feeling good. We had a good matchup. So we'll be able to work. I just want to get plates. Plates. So I'm going for plates. More gold. More gold, more plates. The Herald admit they got a lot. That's a good job by them. This is a little risky. A TF ults of Graves comes bottom. We're kind of fucked, but it's going to be worth the risk, I think. We got to auto this puppy. Auto, auto, auto. He's here. Nice. Oh, this should be really good, right? Ah. Oh, ah, oh, damn. Well played by them. But at least we can get more plates. Good job by their, their bot lane. I could have went a little harder on that. But at the end of the day, we get plates. So that's what we're talking about. We just got 480 gold. 480 gold and Kate sums. Eve, come hit this! We need the gold! Plate gold! Oh, we're gonna get we're gonna shortchanged one plate because of Eve. It dingleberry! Shortchanged. It's fine. Not the end of the world. Again, guys, if you are a team of top main struggling, this is what you have to do. Win top lane, go bot lane. Get some impact on the map. Make them hate their lives. This Kate Yumi had a decent lane? Well, not anymore, because I'm here to ruin it. Ha <laughs> Got it. Bum, 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 bum. These, these tier 2 turrets are often a bait. Getting them early game is not worth it over the plates. Not by any means. Here, it could be okay to stay for it, but I have a lot of gold, so I'm going to go base. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Bum, bum, bum. So I'm going to go Nashers, Lichbane. Nashers, Lichbane, maybe Ludens, maybe Deathcap. We'll see. Probably Ludens before Deathcap. Yeah. Ludens and then Deathcap, I believe. <laughs> T 
Kimo, do you see pokers? Ooh, blue buff. Don't mind if I do. Yeah, they're gone. We can't actually catch the Kate Yumi. Like, that's a deadly duo. Yeah, I think they're AFK. I think they said fuck it. Okay, look at my transcendence. Look at the AP it's giving. This is kind of the concept of the build. Once you hit that two to three item spark with, with the with the CDR, it's like this is a lot of bonus AP. Transcendence gets a lot of bonus AP. Plus 32 right now. 32 AP from a rune. Like that's insane. It's nutty. But again, it's like a three to four item build. It's giving me that much because I have blue buff and I have lucidity boots. Full AP build. Like I said, this is easily countered by any sort of magic resist. They build magic resist, it's like, well, this build sucks. If they have a lot of health, this build sucks. Um, if they, uh, yeah, if you can't go Morello, etc., etc. So this build has a lot of counterplay. But the fact, the reason why we're using it is because they all can be one shot by me, and I'm on my Smurf, so I know I'll get fed. That's why I'm going for this build. And it's fun. <laughs> I wanted to see how much damage I'm doing. Almost, almost. Almost got her. Hey, I got her. Sweet. How on earth did I actually get her? Ninja Tabbies? Hell no. Why would it be efficient? They have a TF and Yumi. I mean, it would be good for Z3, but not good for Z2. Yumi does a lot of magic damage. It would be okay, but not for Teemo. Ninja Tabbies don't give AP. <laughs> I love that. Get him! Pad the KDA! Doink! Mm. Oh! Nice! GG's! Alright guys, if you want to play a viewer game with me, just be a sub and type your in-game name. First come, first serve. Let's play one more before I get off for the day. Who wants to play a viewer game? Hit me with it. Type your in-game name if you're a sub. You got it.